Good day, class. We're going to practice some math together. Let us review pattern sequencing numbers and math skills. So we're going to do this as a little pre-assessment. So we're going to check in. We're going to put number one, two, three, or four in the order things go. So here we have an apple. So first, an apple has a seed. Second, a gets ripe on a tree, and third, we eat it. Let's look at the snowman. First, it snows, then we build our snowman, that's number two, and then he starts to melt because it got hot out. Now let's go to one with four patterns. So we have a person growing. So first, they're a baby, then they're a little girl, then they grow up, and then they get a little bit older. So that's a sequencing of that one. Let's try this one. So we have how a pumpkin grows on the next one. Begins with a seed. Then a vine grows with the blossoms. They're pretty orange. And then it turns into fruit and the pumpkin has to grow. And then we can make a pie out of it. So that's image sequency check-in, and we did that nicely. Now this one's going to be a little harder because we could cut and paste it, but we're going to make it easier. So we're going to sort the fish, sorting objects check up. So we're going to sort the fish into either category one or category two. So I'm going to go with color because you could probably see that better or big versus little. So let's see if we did it by color first. So if we put light, 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 they would go here. Dark, 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 it would go there. But now I'm going to mark the next one on big and little. So let's put little on this one. We'll actually label it little, label it big. So this fish is big, so we're going to give that a number two. This fish is little, he's a one. That's little, he's a one. Oh my, he's big, he's going to get a two. That one's little, it's going to get a one. Little, little, big, big, and big. And that way, we just sorted our fish in two different ways. Our next activity is counting to 20. And I believe we've done, we have done that together, but we'll do it again. Can you count to 20? Put your finger on the number as you count it. Don't miss any. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Well done. Let's try another one together. This one is counting ocean math. How many of each picture do you see? Add them up and write the number in the box. Three plus two equals one, two, three, four, five. Now remember, five is a little skinny man, big fat belly hat on his head. That's easier to remember. One plus three equals one, two, three, four. Three plus three on the snails. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now remember number six has a belly at the bottom and nine has the head at the top. So we just did some addition together, which was well done. We're going to count and match the fruit together next. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we trace eight because they already did the line for us, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 